Hello everyone watching Terrestrial English. On Sunday, the Venezuelan President Nicolas Maduro led the closing ceremony of the National Congress of the Bolivarian Historical Bloc. Our special envoy in Caracas, Belén de los Santos, has the details. We're here in Caracas in the mountains barrack, a historical site of the Venezuelan capital. And this is truly a popular party around us because this is the closure of the Grand Congress of the historical Bolivarian bloc. The Congress that has been underway in Caracas for the past three days, but it's the culmination of a process, a broader process that involved 101,000 assemblies around the country and the delegates came here to discuss their plan. And at this closure, this important event, President Nicolás Maduro has just addressed the delegates, giving him his opinions about this whole process at this event. Also, the president was handed over the proposals that the delegates brought from their territories discussed here in this Congress regarding the seven key transformations that will lead the Venezuelan path, the roadmap for the future. So these proposals that were truly debated among the territories, among the assemblies, and brought by the delegates, these proposals were handed to Nicolás Maduro, who now received them, processed them, and he announced that the, with this proposal, the government plan for the coming years is now done. Venezuela has a new government plan that will be presented to the National Assembly once President Nicolás Maduro is inaugurated for his new term in office. And this is a government plan that has been written by the people. That is the significant part of this process. That means a new instance of democracy, uh, a very innovative form of democracy that involves the design of a government plan by the people in every territory. So that is one of the things among the highlights of the speech that President Nicolás Maduro had here in Caracas was the importance of theoretical thought. One of the points of the Congress for the past day was the the reasoning over and reflection over the concept of the historical block and the importance of formation and the importance of theoretical thought for all the militants to really comprehend what this moment, historical moment entails and what the defense of the Bolivarian Revolution represents. So the, the, the reflection and historical thought, the also popular participation, those are the two key elements of this process that were highlighted and underscored by President Nicolás Maduro, who also said that the world is at a turning point and Venezuela with this process is at the forefront of that battle against imperialism. And that is what is happening here today. That is what the delegates are celebrating around us. And we will continue bringing all the information from here, from Caracas, Venezuela. Thank you, Belen, for the report. For these and more stories, go to our website, www.tresolenglish.net.